Hi everyone. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to connect a Zigbee Smart uh, One Gang switch. It's a Zigbee switch. I'm, sure I'm going to show you how to connect it to a Samsung Smart Thing. this button here with a screwdriver and waiting till the red light starts blinking uh, that will put the switch into a discovery mode the zigbee into a discovery mode so now it's blinking so the switch is in discovery mode now we go in our smart samsung smart thing app and go into things under things you need to press the plus plus there and allow it to search for its thing. Okay, this takes a bit of time sometimes. Allow it to search. Um, sometimes it can come up very fast, sometimes it takes a bit longer. So, give probably a minute or so. Usually, probably in a minute or so, you sh should start getting something on it it all depends on how far your hub is sitting also in this case it's probably sitting around five seven meters away from here uh, there you go so if now found a thing now what you do is um, rename the thing say I'm going to rename it as uh, pantry pantry room pantry room switch okay so I've renamed it as pantry room switch and press done and then save it save it and press ok okay so when you do this it will identify a new device however the device is not ready yet okay it will show you as tiles missing the reason the tile missing is showing is the device does not have the right handler yet on it uh, a device handler is a, a, a piece of code which allow which makes the device understand what uh, what to do when you press switch on it will switch on and when you press switch off it will switch off so to do that what you need to do is go on to the uh, onto the website uh, Samsung smart thing site and log into it uh, log into your account you'll have an account and once you have logged in go into my devices so in this case you can see my devices so click on my devices Okay, so now it's here. So you should see the pantry room switch here. Uh, there you go. Can you see the pantry room switch? Yes, pantry room switch. So select that. So when you select that, it will give you details of that device. Okay, that's the device which we have identified. Now you need to say edit. Edit. Which will allow you to change the device handler type on the on your switch now in this case it has uh, by default selected the 2015 samsung smart tv device handler what we need to do is we need to open click on that and sometimes it's very slow and you need to select the zigbee 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 uh, switch. You need to select that. Okay, select that. Once it's changed to that, you say update, update. Okay, you're done now. Once you have done this, go back to your smart thing switch, a uh, smart thing app, and under the app now you should be able to see. If you go back to home and then go back to devices, you should be able to see 
the smart thing pantry switch okay the pantry switch here so you select that uh, turn it off okay let me start this now see if it work and there you are it's done so by pressing that button you can switch it off and switch it on that's it so this is Zimi smart one gang uh, smart one gang smart switch Zigbee switch um, and it can work with smart thing uh, Samsung smart thing app um, thank you very much